Yo guys, what is up? This is Tom from Unreal Meta and welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm going to show you how you can make a transparent display in Blender so we can start. We don't delete the default cube. Now we can scale the cube and like this by 0 0.5. Yeah, and we have a thick display. Uh, let's make it a bit thinner like this yes that's okay and the rest is just the materials because glass screens are at the edges very sharp and not rounded but you can make them rounded or whatever you like and this will be done in eevee but i think it works in cycles too actually yes so let's go to shading make a new material and we can delete the principal bsdf and then we press N or go to this side and then go to options and change the blend mode from opaque to alpha hashed and the shadow mode to alpha hashed. And now you can close this tab again. Now we make the glass material so you can add a Fernell node. And let's set the IOR to 1. Now let's add a math node and go to multiply and you multiply the fernel by the value of 94 and now you have to make a mix shader and this value goes into the factor you can connect these and you need a glass bsdf and a transparent bsdf because we want the glass transparent like in the middle and glass at the side and just connect them and you get this glass material now you can see it's transparent because i have no other objects in the scene but now you can see it a little bit better what we need to do is check ambient occlusion bloom and screen space reflections the only thing you really need is screen space reflections and you can see how this material changes to nice glass but I like to turn the other things on too. And let's make it a little bit brighter so we can see the display better. And for the next step, it's actually the last step. You have to add an add shader and an emission node. And then you can just grab a texture you like and put it on the screen. But now you can see the screen is bright and it's just not a screen. So you have to make your own texture or can download it from the internet. I will show you in a second what it looks like. So this is the texture I will use and it looks like this. So the background is black and the parts you want to light up, they are blue. Because I want blue light, you can make them red, orange or whatever you like and the parts you want to be transparent, just make them dark. Now you can connect the color to the color and that's basically it, but the screen looks kind of weird. So we can go to UV editing. Let's activate this mode and press A, U, smart UV project. And now you can grab a face like this face and scale this up. We have a screen and if we go to this mode now, you can see it's transparent. You can press A, then deselect this face and just make them black. And now there's nothing on the other faces, but this face is the face with the display. And now you can go to shading again and adjust the strength. So guys, this looks very good. That's why I made Bloom on and yeah, guys, that's how you make a transparent display. I hope you liked this tutorial. If yes, leave a thumbs up. If no, leave a thumbs down. I'll see you next time and bye.